Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. Uh, this is the Stepford map, and um, yeah, I wound the, the game forward a bit. Um, you know, did some work on uh, traffic, added some roads, um, adjusted some things, um, built a wonky interchange. Uh, these things are not as good as they uh, should be, because you can't bring them off at a sharp enough angle. Um, and they're really finicky to build so uh, just uh, so those things they're not as good as they could be but as you can see uh, we've got some real population going on here in Needville and Hawkins and Star City and uh, over here also in our original valley uh, we've got a pretty good uh, agglomeration going and it's uh, working its way through the uh, valleys here and well uh, you can see and that's causing all manner of traffic um, before I did the uh, traffic uh, fix-ups it was literally bumper to bumper standstill all lanes going all the way back all the way around here all the way through here you know all the way back all the way in through here and all the way across here and all the way back up here where it's still bumper to bumper and into here uh, is one of the new roads. Um, so yeah, um, but that's not the project for uh, for this uh, episode. Uh, no, this time around, uh, I'm going to set up the um, fuel uh, supply chain here. So I was looking around, and we have a uh, fuel refinery here. We have an oil refinery here, and then one valley over, we have an oil well. So what we're going to do, we're going to run oil from here to the refinery. Then we're going to bring the uh, refined oil to the fuel refinery. And minus Tirith accepts fuel. So we're going to deliver it here. And we're going to do this all with one train line. Uh, because if I, uh, if I go in here and we look at the uh, um, cargo overlay, we can see that the uh, the fuel area, the industrial area, is over here. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to run the uh, train uh, for this uh, refinery. It's going to run up through here, uh, and somewhere in here, I'm going to put the put a station to drop off, and then it's going to run up probably around through here to the to here. So I'm actually going to uh, build this, where is the start, over here. I'm going to actually build the station here first. Now, I think we grab a cargo station, standard, no catenary. Um, okay, so if I were to get it in about here, we cover pretty much everything. Um, now, we could actually get away with a short station here. It's going to be a through station, so uh, we should be able to get away with a short station. Uh, and that means I can probably put it up here. Um, we're going to need uh, two tracks, though. Okay, so I'm going to take out some uh, roads here, uh, and then going to put the... Uh, I'm going to take out some roads here and pause it, and then I'm going to put the station. Now, if I put it here, I think a little closer down this way. Yeah, I think if I put it here, it'll probably do the best. Yeah. So if I do this... Yep, I'll do that. And then I'll take this road out as well. Yeah, I know, I just took out a uh, chunk of my uh, demand. But I'm going to put a cargo building over here as well. All right? And then, if we just chuck a road in here, right? If we chuck a road in like this. Nope. 
like this. Yeah, that doesn't quite. Um, okay, so if we come over like this and like this, yeah, we get uh, we get the uh, the tendrils. So that uh, gives us full coverage. Then I need to have a station over here. This one's only going to need one track. We'll make it the uh, full, the, the, the standard, the so-called standard length. And I'll, I'm going to put it back here. Now I'm putting it that far back uh, just because I need to uh, right. Uh, no catenaries. Uh, I need to be able to make sure I can get up to here. Bridge pillar coll collision, but it will work. Actually, I kind of like that idea. So let's uh, find a. No, let's let's not use Jolly Green. Um, uh, let's. Uh... What about this one? Still bridge pillar collisions. Uh, what is the pillar colliding with? Why? Okay, well, it's colliding with that. If we take those out, that might work better. Okay. So, we bring this around like that. And let's, uh, let's grab that. That. Oh, this will this will work out nicely. Okay, well, I'll do that, and then back here, I'm gonna run that up as an embankment. Right. Okay. Now that allows me to get this going. Yep. And in we go. Bridge pillar collision with what? Road. Okay, well, let's uh, build that to there. Okay. Good. You know what? If I uh, take uh, this whole bit out here, I can do an embankment for all of it. And I think that would be better. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay, so what will happen is our, uh, our refined oil will come in this side and then the uh, fuel will come out and get dropped off here on the way back. Now, uh, I think we could just wang it straight through the mountain here. Hmm. Well, that's that's affordable, so maybe I'll do that. But I'm going to need a uh, station here. Yeah. Uh, okay. This is also going to need two two platforms. Now, can I if I do do it here? Yeah, that gives me the maximum space to get it up there. Um, I'm going to end up with a level crossing here, I think. Well, let's uh, let's see. We'll go out. Really? Construction not... Why is construction not possible? Um, okay, if I do this... Well, we'll make that level there, right? Um, should put the road back, though. Uh, so if I do this... What? Why is construction not pop... Why is... Okay, I can do that. Well, if I do this... 
Well, that will get me over it. Okay. Well, if I come back here, I think, yeah, that is uh, better. You know what? I'm going to take the stone bridge on that one. Okay, now if I connect that, now can I just upgrade this? Construction not possible. Yeah, see, this is the, uh, yeah, see, I can upgrade that, but not, see, that's, um, that's the annoying thing, right? Uh, what? That's new. Um, okay, um, how do I fix that? Well, I'll start out by, uh, upgrading this. Right, um, and then now, yeah, I can't. Uh, now, can I get it to connect now? I wonder. Okay, well, if I just take this and connect that, and then I take the Take this, connect that, can I get, oh, I can get that out. Now, can I upgrade? No. Okay. Well, uh, okay. No, roads, right. So connect that. Right. Now, can I... Okay, I can get that to connect. And I can get that to come out. Okay, yeah, that'll work. Um, that's horrid. You see, this is what I was saying about these things being a little too finicky. Um, right. Now, can I get these to all be the ramp things? Yeah, I can. Uh, okay. Well, that looks a little less bad than it did, actually. So, so there's a win, I guess. Uh, right. Okay. Well, you know what? We can actually let the clock run now. Uh, right. Now, what were we doing? We were uh, putting some tracks in. Now, the track, um, I'd, I think it would be better if it went, but we can't get up into, we just can't get up that high. Okay, so we do have to come through. Right, good. Uh, that, uh, what happens if we just, wang it straight through. Well, that gives us a $5 million build. But... I think, yeah, I think that's the, uh, that's the thing to do. Okay. Right. Uh, I think that's about the best we could do there. Now, we need to get over to here. And I think again... Well, this time, I think we can actually go around this way. Yeah, I think we can. Come through here, maybe? Okay, what happens if we do that? Um, okay, so if I were to put a track here on the level, okay, can that get into here? It can. It'll be slow, but it can.
Yeah. Yeah, I think I think that is uh, acceptable. Okay. So I'll do that. And then we just need to go through this little shoulder here and around. Okay. So if we pop through the the shoulder thing. Oh yeah, we got to get over the road too. Um ah, we can get over the road. Uh yeah, we can. Okay. So that's acceptable. Um okay. Bring the other track. Um right, now we need to get over here. Now uh I need a uh station with one uh track, I guess. And stick it there. Now, how high up is that? Whoops. Um, hmm. Well, how hard is that going to be? Well, I can get that. Okay, let's see. That is quite, um, that's quite substantial, actually. Um, right. Okay, well, uh, we'll get this over to here on, no, yeah, we'll go up, okay, now, uh, let's put on the uh, contours, oh yeah, yeah we're definitely going to have to do the uh, viaduct, okay, well, at this point, we can afford the uh, the viaduct, so I uh, might as well just do it. So if I do this, and I give it that, it's much... Uh, that doesn't even look like it works, does it? That's jolly green. Um, what about... Oh, that one looks substantialer. Yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, but over here, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that so that this works better. Okay. Right. Now, if we go in here and we get the smoothing gun out and we upstrength it. Uh, we can make this uh, look less less bad. Yeah. Okay, I think that will uh, that will be acceptable. I think now I need to finish building this. And then over here. Yeah, that's, uh, uh, let's replace that with something slightly faster than stone. Uh, right, okay, and here we go. And we'll grab that thing again. Okay. Good. Well, that didn't take too terribly long. Uh, you know, you're going to need to fling some signals on that, aren't you? Aren't you? Yeah, I suppose I should. Um, okay, so we're going to need one here. For sure. Um, probably in the middle here. Either side of here. Uh... A couple in this length. I'm probably going to have to run four or five trains on here ultimately. So uh, definitely uh, worth uh, 
setting up the uh, the signals appropriately. Um, do that. Uh, now the um, the stations do have built-in signals, but they only apply if uh, if a, a train is stopping there. Uh, if the train's going through, the station uh, implied signal is invisible. And uh, now that's why I'm putting signals on either side of the uh, station there. Uh, okay, so that's, uh, that's uh, track. Uh, okay, now uh, we're going to put a... Uh, I remember that was flat, so I'm going to do this, and uh, you know, just because, and uh, stick a depot in here. There we go. Uh, right now, all we need to do is uh, fling a uh, train at this and uh, see what happens. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to build the train. Uh, yeah, that's kind of necessary, isn't it? Uh, okay, so we're going to run diesel. Now, uh, the PA uh, has 1680 kilowatts. Uh, this one has 1450. That Okay. So we're going to chuck a PA on there. And then we're going to go for cargo. And we want tank cars uh, probably probably those you know 10 of them is probably enough we'll buy one of those you know what I'm gonna need at least two on here because of the length that's three yeah I know I said at least two so new line so we pick up here, then we stop here, and then we stop here, and then we stop here. Yeah, that should be what we need. Okay, so this is going to be... Um, Right, it's going to be cargo rail, uh, hill valley, minus Tirith fuel chain. Okay. Yep. Now, while I'm thinking about it, I'm going to uh, rename these. So this will be hill valley oil well. Yeah. And then uh, this, uh, Swallow Falls uh, Oil Refinery, yep. And this is the Minus Tirith Fuel uh, Refinery, yep. And then this is the Minus Tirith Fuel Drop-Off. Yeah. Okay. Now, let's go find us a train. Uh, this one will do. And let's just ride it around. I guess that uh, town there is probably Swallow Falls, eh? I think uh, this leg of the uh, 
the journey is relatively level, uh, relatively little elevation change. So that should mean that uh, we get up a decent head of steam once we're around the corner here. Yeah, we're going to get up a decent head of steam in a diesel uh, loco, right? Yeah, that's, uh, that's definitely going to happen, right? I suppose we could have wound around the, uh, the valley uh, edge there and uh, approached the uh, station from the other side. Uh, but, you know, I don't think that was uh, necessarily uh, a better solution. Uh, yeah, I don't think it was. I, I think this was uh, just fine. Okay, there's our uh, previous train uh, pulling out. So we get to see the train go by. It'd be kind of cool if uh, the uh, numbers on the sides of the uh, the wagons would uh, be different. Uh, <laughs> that'd be kind of neat. I think I might have too many trains on here. No, yeah, no, probably not. It should be fine. Uh, when the uh, when when everything uh, starts ramping up. Uh, I'm just, I'm going to jump out of here briefly. Uh, what's the rate? 772. Yeah, I have too many trains on there. Um, maybe it's not too many trains. Maybe just too much capacity. I'm going to... Yeah, I think I can knock off uh, three wagons on each train. Yeah, I'll probably knock off three wagons on each train, and then uh, that should uh, maybe four wagons, but three wagons for sure. Uh, that'll reduce the uh, capacity. Uh, but, you know, I think I'll just run it as is for now. Kind of looks neat with that gravel road in the valley there, doesn't it? Yeah, when I made the map, I made sure all the uh, towns were connected. Uh, that's partly why we have that massive growth in the uh, other towns back there where we've got passenger service. I think I'm probably going to leave the, uh, you know, leave that area relatively uh, isolated, right, from uh, the rest of the towns for a bit. And maybe what I'll do is uh, go off on the other side of the map and build up a passenger service area and then put some airports between the two, you know, air traffic between the two. Uh, that could be interesting. Okay, there's our depot where we started. There's our first stop. And now we're making it pretty close to the uh, track speed here. Okay. Well, we're going to actually pick up some uh, refined oil, so there's that. So, we drop off our 39 crude, and we're going to pick up, what, about 20 uh, refined oil, maybe? Eighteen, anyway. I guess 18 is about 20. 
And here we go. Through our uh, whacking great tunnel. This bridge here actually came out okay. Uh, this uh, stone uh, viaduct thing. These trains will actually run faster if I knock a couple wagons off them too. Now, are we going uphill here? Or is it relatively level? This is a uh, quite a long tunnel. Well, um, I think that's the last signal in the tunnel. Uh, oh, there's a train going the other way. Yep, there we go. Uh, there's the uh, drop-off station. Well, it doesn't look like there's any issues with the track. It looks like it uh, came out quite nice. Hey, there's the other train. Okay, and we'll pick up some fuel on the way out. Okay, I'm going to jump off the train now. And, uh, yeah, it's probably going to pick up, like, nine fuel or something like that. Looks like it picked up eight. Okay. Nine. There we go. Ten. So picked up ten before leaving. Okay. Okay, so you can see all of these uh, industries that I clobbered when I put the station in are have uh, respawned. So, uh, yeah. Uh, clobbering it wasn't uh, necessarily a, a bad option. Okay, if I connect that. Can't connect that, that's why it's that way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so uh, this here, you can see that... Uh, so if I bring this back up, uh, you don't have to have a platform that the train fits in. I should probably move the signal back there. Yeah, I probably should put it there. Oh, it's autosave. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's probably better. Um, and that probably means this one should be back here, too. Yeah. Uh, okay. Right, and that'll send the train back uh, this way. Okay, this, um, this road's not that busy. Oh, uh, there's something I need to uh, do here. 
Take the traffic light out of there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that'll keep that from backing up. Uh, right. Um, I don't think there should be... Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's... I'm just taking a boo. Um, the traffic here can probably be sorted out with a bus lane. Um... And this here... Uh... goes up here. Yeah, this is the, uh, yeah, this is this, uh, highway up here, uh, and it's, uh, running straight into here. Um, yeah, okay, so, uh, a lot of this could be fixed with, uh, uh bus lanes or, uh, slightly wider roads, uh, so that the, uh, the traffic doesn't get uh, jammed up. Now I want to uh, just uh, see if there's any of the usual uh, problems with a uh, new road causing a traffic light somewhere. But yeah, so so it looks like that'll be my uh, traffic fixing project between uh, parts here. Um, Anyway, uh, that uh, that's one more uh, uh, set of industries connected up. Now, what would be ideal is if there's another oil well somewhere nearby. There's an oil refinery up here. Um, okay, there. There's a refinery over there. Where is the oil? There's a fuel refinery over there. Well, there's two oil there. And one here. Couple. Okay, so there's some down there. So, uh, what I'll need to do is uh, bring up, you know, to maximize production uh, here. I'll need to bring in oil from another oil well, which I need to find. Well, there's one up here, which I probably want to pair with that. Okay, there's one over here. Well, that could be a, a project and a half. Hmm. Yeah, I'll have to, uh, I'll have to look around find a uh, oil well that I can uh, bring into this mix. Um, yeah, I'll need to, to look around. Uh, meanwhile, it looks like I've got more farms I can connect up if I can find a food processing plant. Um... Right, we've got... Okay, so this here, what's our, uh, what's our, our uh, line rate? 224. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's got enough transport capacity for the moment. Okay, so... Uh, it looks like I'm going to have uh, some uh, challenges getting the, the next uh, project online. The next project maybe should be... Maybe it should be getting uh, steel production online or something like that. No. No, that... I don't think that's going to you know, work out, no. Uh, okay, anyway, uh, that's going to be going to be it for this, uh, this episode. Got our, our project uh, sorted out here. Uh, and then it's just a matter of uh, getting another oil well in the mix at some point. Uh, anyway, 
Uh, that's going to be all for this time. So, uh, uh, I guess stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And uh, see you back next time.